the first of all there was a musical rivalry between the bands because the time could kick their ass and often did you would think that would be a great package like people would love that but it became sort of a a contest or, or you know it's like the time was all of prince's funkiness the management and the business people started looking at it and saying you know we've got to split you guys up because the time is a funk band and you guys aren't it was a stylistic thing as much as anything else because the nature of the songs the repertoire was was different oh, yeah it was hardcore r b when you get when you I mean you can't fuck with a ten minute vamp on cool <laughs> Cove is 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 it's, it's a tremendous song. It ain't gonna do to a house what ten minutes of cool does. Seven seven seven. I mean was very professional it was obvious that he didn't tolerate the bullshit so it was a very professional operation now still there were a lot of opinionated people and it was there was some you had a real sense of drama when you go on stage like that you're you're not only good but you're pissed and that's kind of like when we would people see us and y'all man y'all were amazing and y'all man y'all the attitude they don't know no this was mad for real and it was the one way in time where you could get it out and it wasn't <laughs> destructive, but it was like, he was up there playing sh red teeth and meaning it. And obviously <laughs> it didn't take long to learn a lot of it had to do with um, what had happened with Jimmy Jam and Terry before I joined. I guess they were told, they were told not to go record other songs for other people.